A teenage boy who allegedly chased down and stabbed a schoolgirl to death as she protected her friend has today been pictured for the first time. Hassan Sentamu has been accused of murdering 15-year-old Eliane Andam while she made her way to school in Croydon, South London, last September. He had been granted anonymity due to his age but can now be identified for the first time after turning 18. Sentamu has pleaded guilty to manslaughter after he accepted inflicting the fatal knife wound but he has denied murder and possessing a blade in a public place. Sentamu, who lives in Croydon, is due to stand trial for murder on November 25th. A court has heard how the alleged attack on Eliane last September was brutal. The keen gymnast and cheerleader was allegedly ambushed shortly after she got off a bus with friends near the Whitgift shopping centre. She had been attempting to take back her friend's teddy bear from an ex-boyfriend on the way to school when she was killed, the court heard. Passers-by attempted to save Eliane, but tragically, she passed away shortly after. A post-mortem later found she suffered multiple stab wounds. Hundreds of people, including rapper Stormzy, paid tribute to the teen in a candlelit vigil. Eliane's mother, Dorcas Andam, said her daughter was smart, charismatic, and loved living life to the fullest in a moving tribute. The mum added, she brought joy to so many, including her friendship group. She was an amazing, beautiful girl. She loved and touched lives around her. The schoolgirl's family also said they were struggling to comprehend this painful tragedy. They added, our hearts are broken. Eliane was a beautiful person inside and out who loved Jesus. She was intelligent, thoughtful, kind, and had a bright future ahead.